Coparo manages all the branch creation, merging, conflict resolution through its user interface and it automates a lot of things but it's nice to know what's happening on the back end. So with Coparo you have long living environment branches. All of your environments are going to have a long living environment branch tied to themselves. A production would be usually be tied to a master or a main branch. Then you'll have a branch for your UAT environment, any branches for your testing environments and ultimately your dev environments are going to have individual branches for their own. Every user story that you're working on is going to have a feature branch tied to it. And how and for the feature branches, the feature branches are created out of the master branch or the main branch. And for every commit that you do on the user story, Copado does two commits. The first commit happens on the feature branch itself that is tied to the user story. And the second commit happens to the environment branch to which the user story is tied to. So if you started working off in the dev environment and uh, you're, this is where you're developing this user story for opportunity management, then the first commit Copado that you do through the Copado UI on this user story is gonna happen on the feature branch and automatically Copado will do uh, duplicate this commit over the environment branch as well. When it's time to move these user stories to the higher environments, you choose which user stories you want to promote and deploy on the Copado UI, which ends up creating a promotion branch. So this promotion branch is created out of the destination or the target environments branch. Thus, it has all the source code that is currently present in the target environment. And then Copado tries to merge those feature branches into the promotion branch. If you have any merge conflicts, this is where you'll hit with them and you can resolve them on the Copado UI. You can run validations over here and if everything looks good, the deployment can be triggered which ends up merging this promotion branch into your target environments branch. Similarly, if you want to promote it to the production environment, the same things, the same scenario is going to play out. A promotion branch would be is going to get created, your feature branch would be merged to it and then ultimately it will be deployed as well as merged to the production branch. This is how it looks like zoomed out and if I try to include another user story and try to promote both of them together this is how it will look like that for promotion P01 we are trying to deploy two user stories together so a single promotion branch would be created both of these user stories feature branch will be merged into that promotion branch uh, one by one depending upon the user story order and again if any conflict resolution needs to happen any validations need to run they'll be run over here and then you can uh, then then through Copado's UI you can trigger the deployment which ends up deploying not only through to the environment but as well as merging this promotion branch back into the target environment.